So it appears there's been some last minute chaos in the launch for Star Wars Shatterpoint, at least in the UK. So I was affected by this, but I managed to get away around it, which I'll go through in a minute. Um, and I've seen on the Facebook group for Shatterpoint that lots of other people have been affected in the same way. So as far as I'm aware, it's a problem in the UK. Um, not sure how, fur how much further it goes. It may, be, may not be any further at all. But basically, lots and lots of customers are having various online retailers either telling them that their order has been delayed by two weeks or that their order has been cancelled because they haven't received stock. So basically, the problem is that tomorrow is the 2nd of June. That is the launch day for Star Wars Shatterpoint. Lots and lots of people are saying that Asmodee have got in touch with the online only retailers and said, because you're not a bricks and mortar store, we are cancelling your order and you will start getting your things from the 16th of June. So that's two weeks from tomorrow. Now, I was notified of this at 3.45 today. So today is the 1st of June. It's the day before the game launches. So I was chasing Darksphere, who I ordered the expansions from. I was chasing them and saying, right, where's, you know, I haven't, I noticed it hasn't been picked. I haven't received any sort of dispatch confirmations yet. Is it going to, am I going to get my order tomorrow? And what I got back almost immediately was, uh, your order's been pushed back to the 16th of July due, due to unforeseen logistics problems. Um, now, Darksphere are pretty bad at letting you know when there's a problem. And reading into all of the other things that people are saying, this has got nothing to do with, uh, with logistics. This is Asmodee putting the kibosh on the launch of this game. Now, let me be very, very clear. I think that one of the most important things in this hobby is support for bricks and mortar game stores. Um, because without them, you know, they are the lifeblood of our hobby. Um, and without them, the world is a, a pretty dim place, to be honest with you. So I think it's very, very important to support them. But at the same time, it has to be very clear what's going on for everyone else. Now, it is possible as well that this is a complete admin error from the online stockists as well. Uh, and I'm not entirely sure on that, but I have seen some online stockists saying that their stock is going to be released on the 16th of June as well. So, and that is some people that I'd seen selling it this week because, you know, there's a bit of a mad rush for it, blah, blah, blah. Um, but certainly I know that a lot of people have had their orders either cancelled or pushed back right now. Now, to get around that, what you can do is you can order direct from Element Games. And I'll pop a link in the description. It's an affiliate link, so if you use it, it helps me, but it costs you nothing extra. And basically, I know that they are taking orders and dispatching them. So I know of someone who has placed an order and received a dispatch notification within about 10, 15 minutes, to be honest with you. But that was that was something that was placed today. So if you order, place your order now, assuming you do it today on the 1st of June, um, you'll probably get dispatch notification tomorrow now and get your delivery on Saturday. Certainly better than the 16th of June. Also, from a personal perspective, it is quite funny because I'm waiting for my package and I do expect to receive it tomorrow. I've already had dispatch notification, despite all of the uh, all of the little bits of confusion here, and that is from Element Games, who do seem to still be dispatching the product. Um, it is quite funny because my unboxing video was going <laughs> to have a little bit of focus on me basically saying that I'm about to give up on Kill Team. Uh, I've got a ridiculous amount of Kill Team stuff, um, but I'm just not very happy with the release strategy that Games Workshop have been putting on that product specifically um, in terms of making it very, very difficult to get hold of. And they're obviously, if you do buy the, the things separately, uh, there's a pricing issue as there. It becomes very, very expensive. So I was expecting to push my future into Star Wars Shatterpoint. Um, and although this isn't ideal, clearly, um, I, I, I just I do see this as being a hiccup, that it won't be a problem going forward. But let me know how you feel about this. Have you had your order cancelled? Have you been affected in any way? Uh, or had your order pushed back? Um, two weeks isn't a long time, but for those of you, those of you who are looking forward to playing it tomorrow um, or Saturday, 
it can be very disappointing. So obviously have to wait a little bit of extra time. Um, hopefully this will get sorted out sooner rather than later, but I don't expect Hasmadi to go back on what they've said. So just to sum up, they are forcing support for bricks and mortar stores. They also did that with the Ashoka promotional mini, um, which is very good. But obviously this information hasn't filtered through to everyone. I have seen online stores selling it with a release date of the 16th. Um, but then I do know that there's a lot of people that are expecting to get it tomorrow, but have obviously been affected negatively in this way. What I do know, however, is that all of this stuff will be on its way very, very soon. So the maximum you're gonna have to wait is two weeks for it. Um, and I'm really looking forward to it. I'm gonna be having lots of supporting content for this game. Um, so I'll be having unboxings, I'll be doing review, a review at some point, and more importantly, I'll be reviewing all of the individual little warbands that come out as and when they arrive. So if you want to see all of that, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell button to make sure you're notified when I release the videos. And with any luck, my first one will be out probably on Saturday. So yeah, I hope, I'll look forward to that. And sorry to be the bearer of bad news, check your emails if you've ordered this just to see if you're affected. But yeah, leave it there. I'll catch you later. See ya.